Keeping children home to protect them from the coronavirus could be exposing them to a different kind of threat. KNWA's Clarissa Bustamante is in Rogers today to show us why child abuse could rise during the pandemic. With kids not going to school every day, the Children's Advocacy Center says it's losing a line of defense in the fight against child abuse. But there are things you can do to help. Natalie Tibbs, the executive director of the center in Benton County, said the quietness of the abuse hotline during this time speaks volumes. She says a majority of reporting comes from teachers who now can't see the kids in person. So she's calling on community members, neighbors, and people who come into contact with these children to become watchdogs and help keep them safe. That's what's important right now is that neighbors have to just be concerned. This is a time to take care of each other and to look out for each other. And this isn't a time to just soul up and sit idly by. We have to be concerned about not only our own household, but the households next to us. For teachers instructing virtually, Tibbs encourages you to be extra vigilant and ask simple questions like, what does your day look like and do you feel safe to ensure the child is being treated properly at home? In Rogers, Clarissa Bustamante, KWA North. Northwest Arkansas News.